Hey everyone, in this video I will be doing kind of like a product review. Uh, the product is called Crack. Uh, <laughs> um, you know, of course it was done to get, you know, attention and get people talking about it. And what does it do? It says a styling treatment with UV and thermal protection and it works instantly to smooth, nourish, protect, mend, and shine. Um, I bought this product from Folica. I got a Groupon and it was buy a Groupon for Folica.com for $23 and then get $50 worth of product. And this was about 20 bucks, so that was the only way I was going to buy this product. It was too expensive for my taste, and the bottle is too small, but I wanted to see if it worked. The reviews were great, and I figured it was a good opportunity to spend money that I wouldn't normally spend on a product that I wouldn't ordinarily buy. So um, what I'm going to do today, as you guys can see, my hair is like frizzy. It's a braid out. I mean, it's not an intentional braid out, but I had my hair in braids, and I took the braids out. Then I got caught in the rain when my hair was in a ponytail, a braid out ponytail, so um, that's why it kind of looks more frizzy in the front and more crinkly in the back because it was in a ponytail, so it was smoothed out and the water kind of hit the front. Uh, what I'm going to try to do is use this product to, you know, moisturize the hair a little bit, shape it, and then I'll be out the door because I'm late as usual. So uh, I've used it before and it gives the hair slip and I wouldn't really recommend it for someone with natural hair I would more so recommend it for someone who had relaxed hair because it's light it keeps the hair shiny as well and also I feel like if the hair is straight and then you won't lose too much product because you don't have to use so much product but um you know it's good it's a heat protectant as well so if you straighten your hair a lot and you're unnatural then it may work for you as well but I'm just gonna Take some of the product, this is how it comes out. And I really don't want to use too much more than this because that's a decent amount of the actual container. But I want to see if I can, you know, shape my hair using this. So, now I've not done this before, so, you know, I'm testing it out for you guys as well as for myself. So I have a mirror below me, I'm just going to check time to time to see how things are going. Cause it looks kind of dead and you know I want to bring some life back into it first I'm just kind of distributing the product amongst the crinkles to separate them now this product does make the hair very easy to manage and manipulate that's one thing I'll give it Yeah, so that's definitely not going to be enough. The amount that I took, I have to use way more than what I did. And I want to keep the crinkles as separate as possible to eliminate as much of the frizz as possible. Alright, round two, you can see why I don't recommend this for natural hair so much. More products. Now I've only used it twice before and I was using it on my braids for UV protection. That's all I really was using it for. Not really so much for moisture. Even if you don't like the results, you know, it's a good opportunity to look at a product and say that you won't buy it. So basically, I get to save you guys money because you don't get to try a product that you, you know, wouldn't like.
time. This area is practically gone, all of the straightness. I mean, all of the crinkles in this area is pretty much gone. If I had time, I would braid it for an hour or two and let it start to wave again, but I really don't have the time. I don't know. Because usually when I hear it's braided and I remove the braids, I just, you know, blow dry it and wash my hair after I blow dry it. So for natural hair, I would give this, you know, product a rating out of five, maybe like a two, because this product doesn't do anything that my products that I already have doesn't already do. But for straightened hair, I might give it a four. Because like I said, it's very light. It makes the hair very easy to separate. So if you have kind of like tangly hair, it's very easy to get through the sections. Um, because typically I wouldn't have been able to pull the sections apart so easily like that. Um, because it's already been three days since I've had my hair out of the braids and this braid up. Basically, that's my opinion of the product. I hope I helped. Um, as far as this hairstyle, I don't think this is going to work. I love the Sideshow Bob look, but not necessarily with it looking so straight in the front. So, I'm probably going to clip it up. I don't know, guys. I'll be back. Alright, I'm back. So, I tried working with the product and I didn't really like what was going on with my hair and I really do have to go so I'm just going to try to play with the hair and basically see what style I could get that's wearable without me looking too crazy I think this might kind of work. Alright, so I just have some straight bobby pins. I have one. One seems like it was secure, but I'm just going to try another. Alright, so I'm kind of styling on the go, but this is good enough. I'm just going to you know go and then I'll see you guys in another video where I will probably talk about a great scissor that I bought for my hair I've been buying a lot of hair scissors and a lot of them haven't been working so well so I'll probably talk about that in the next video and I'll see you guys bye